In this video, I will be going to an NCAT North Carolina NT, yes, Aggie Pride basketball game, my nigga. Now I'm living up. It is Greek night tonight, so we're gonna step out a little bit, see what they're hitting for. I've never been to an NCAT basketball game at all. And yes, I'm a junior. I've never been to one. I've been to a football game. I've been to homecoming. I've been to the concerts, been to all that. I've never been to a basketball game. So today is my first ever appearance at a basketball game. Let's get straight to it. Hold on, hold on. First off, fit check, fit check, fit check, fit check. Hold on, sweet. Hold on, nigga. Y'all know about this bit. This that, this that drip. That's that soul, nigga. That is soul, nigga. That is, that is, that is, that is, that is sauce, nigga. Come on, man, stop fucking playing with me, bro. You know I got the little look, look. So we got the, we got the J Down. <clears throat> it's all fake, by the way. It's all fake, by the way. We got the J Down A6 on the feet. We got the Carhartt on the body. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Carhartt on the body. We got the, you know what I'm saying? Polo Slim Fit. Y'all, hey, my niggas, y'all know what the fuck going on with these hoes. Hey, Polo Slim Fit right here. Then we got the North Face all white. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just ruining it. You're ru look at my lips. You're ruining it. Stupid. <laughs> so, nah, let me show you to it, chat. Hey, look. I catch y'all niggas over there when I walk into the gym. Nigga, the shit out on that stupid. Oh, shit. You nigga moving crazy out of that motherfucker, chat. Nah, I'm finna walk. I'm finna walk up there. Nah, these shades is type dark, though, boy. You know I had to re-up on some white shit, hey. <laughs> I'm on the way to the basketball game right now. They said it started seven. I think they said tip off was seven thirty, if I'm not mistaken. I think I think it's seven thirty. Not too sure. Pulling up. See, look, I left the gym. I just recorded my combat video day fifty-seven, I believe. I just left the gym at like six o'clock. Got here, shower, got everything, got everything ready by six forty-five. Now I'm leaving at like seven seven o five. Hey, look, hey. I be moving quick, my nigga. It's kind of hard to see any bitches like. These real life for like when you in the club and shit, this is hella lights. I can actually see, I just gotta like stare and shit. But I can actually stare because niggas don't know where I'm looking. See, that's the, that's the thing of shades, bro. You can throw on shades and niggas not gonna know where the fuck you looking at, so man. I really wanna uh, capture tip off, see if I can get that in the video. If not, shit, ski. I'ma see if I can get an interview too. Look, I'ma try my hardest to get an interview from one of them niggas. Yo, yo, see me, yo, 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 number 34, 34, 34, come here, talk to me, talk to me. Yo, yo, what's, what's a few words you would use to, um, type shit, you know what I'm saying? He was just, hey, look, don't let a ball be around during halftime. <laughs> don't let a ball be sitting around during halftime, nigga, you already know I'm on that shit. Like, white on rice, man. <laughs>
is talking crazy on God A talking crazy right now. Excuse me, brothers, how y'all doing? Where you going? Hey, nigga, look, that was my mama. That's a real life nigga. Real life nigga right there, Twit. Okay, then you count. My mama, that's a real life nigga. What do you say? Where you going? Nigga, right in my seat. Fuck you talking about? Work out, eight. Work out, eight. What's your buddy? Real niggas in life. I like, just love when real niggas look out, bro. And hey, work out one, work out one. We got a little all day 15 right here. We be, I ain't gonna lie, we be clamping this shit. We just gotta score. Our defense actually. Ain't one. To number two. What I see, like, our defense, we be trapping niggas like shit. That's his second. Returning for the Aggies, number three, Kevin and Shell, number 16, Nick and Kudis. Big round of applause for number five, say? Evan Twitter, what did and number 13, say? Jason Murphy. I just call that nigga Jokic. <laughs> I just call that nigga Jokic. That's kind of disrespectful, though. If I knew his name, I'd call him by his name, but I don't know his name. Even Black is committed to celebrating and uplifting HBCU students. That's why at and is proud to sponsor North Carolina AT Athletics. And at this time, we'd like to do a Black History trivia question. You have a chance to win second generation AirPods and an at and Dreamin' Black Bucket hat. That nigga talking crazy right now. AirPods, wait, what? So we're not going to be doing that, but we do want you to visit at and DreamingBlack.com to learn more about hey, how at and supports the down. now. Four minutes left, chat. Four minutes left. We locking in. We locking in, Twin. Number three. Old head tall. Old head tall. Like, really gotta put it. You 
this nigga's breath stinks so bad. It makes no sense. It makes and for the Aggies, number 13, Jason Murphy. Big round of applause for zero, nigga count eight. two. Nigga, eight was talking crazy. I think one, the nice is on Hampton. My Chinese ain't saying the team. Hampton, Shooting Hampton Pirates two. versus A&T Aggies. 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 Mentality, my mindset That's in high school. Oh my God, I would have went D1. Oh my God, I would have went D1. I still got a chance, though. I still got a chance. I still got a chance. At the line, shooting two for the Aggies, number 16. Dang, they, they done trying to injure Yokis. They trying to injure Yokis, man. NPC conversations get on my nerves, bro. Like NP NPC niggas really just be so annoying, bro. The previous play is under review. Yeah, run that shit back again. Minute left chat, minute left chat, minute left chat. Say you want to get crap. Just say that.
two seconds left. I thought I was going to get on the screen. Don't forget to join us for the same atmosphere Saturday beginning at 4 p.m. as your night is taking on the Phoenix of Elon University. Also, join us on Sunday when your lady Aggies, who are number one. One nigga trying to hoop and bust a nigga ass. Like, y'all got to really hoop as a team, but I can't see shit. God damn. I can't see. Where the fuck am I at? So, nigga got to take that. Nigga got to take the shades off. Nigga looking, sh nigga looking like a snack. Nigga looking like a snack. We slide to him. All right, chat. We walking back. We walking back. One, one by one. So, hold up. You know how nigga happy and shit? We done got that one. Nigga win. You know, everybody for these. <laughs> And you know, you know when Chapel Hill, when Chapel, uh, when Chat was in the Final Four, <laughs> I remember when, me and one of my, um, me and one of some of my former friends, bro, we went to motherfucking Chapel Hill game, and we went to, um, I think they was in like the Final Four. They was playing like Kansas City or Kansas, um, they was playing Louisville or some of them niggas. And gang, niggas said if they win, niggas getting free ass. That shit was so funny. Like everybody's gonna be so happy. They was like, if they win, nigga, we get free ass. I was like, bro, what? But nah, man, that's what's up, man. I'm fucking with this shit. Fucking with it. Fucking with it. This concludes. I went to an NCAT basketball game. Yeah, I attended. I went to. I attended. I'm fucking with this shit, bro. I'm fucking with this shit. And um, I'm glad I went, bro. I'm glad I experienced a good game. We seen a win. Now it's time to eat some food and fucking relax, get back to editing, get back to real work. I mean, this is working, but like when you can when you can spend time by yourself, like when you can actually spend time working while you're enjoying the work, that's when life really get easy. Like when you love what you do, that's when the shit really start like working and, and like shit start just coming to fruition, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Y'all niggas gotta really, really sit down. I'm not worried about the hoes. But you see how the hoes came to me though. 
but I'm not worried about the hose. Like, that's just, that's really, like, the last thing I'm worried about. Let me slide on her and slide. What are you going to do for me? You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm really about the content, really about making sure that I can't really run this campus, bro. Like, it's nigga, I don't see nobody on campus except Mikey who really be out here influencing the people. And I got to do a better job. I got to learn from what I post right here. I definitely got to learn this shit, but that don't mean I'm, I'm not capable of doing it. You got to first believe, my nigga. Believe and you will achieve, my nigga. Once y'all niggas I understand. And I'm out here doing this shit by myself, bro. I mean, it's kind of sad, but... You know, I don't, I don't really be needing, like, friends. I don't really be needing people to, to go places with because, you know, it's always one person that's always going to with me, and that's that's God. That's that's the universe, you know what I'm saying? That's the man upstairs. And um, that's really all I need when I walk around and I do things like this. I just want to say, thank God. Thank God. God did. God did. Stupid ass. <laughs> no, I'm fucking with it, though, chap. We on the way back to the crib. This going to be a little talk. If you don't want to see the talk, it's all good. I promise you it's all good. But like I'm saying, man, A&T is a wonderful, wonderful university. I'm trying to post this shit for niggas who don't go to A&T and want to go, and then also for the niggas who are already here and shit. You know what I'm saying? Let me cross the street. Oh, shit. Don't get hit. Let me cross the street. Oh, shit. Don't get hit. <laughs> Let me cross the street. Oh, shit. Don't get hit. <laughs> Stupid eye. Actually, right, I want y'all niggas to understand, like, this shit really tough. Like, I just love, I love how I can go out here and just be myself and I have to worry about what other people be thinking bro that's really why I be doing this shit like I'm not doing this shit for the views or, or doing this shit for the money or, or doing this shit for the, the clout or doing this shit for the status like it's, it's really about just getting out here huh What's your tap in it's my name Mark Kid. Mark right, Mark Kid with a Q right, one Q and two D's all right. yes sir <laughs> yes sir damn let me get, get the YouTube twin damn they trying to look out nigga they trying to look out nigga Fuck you time out. Hey, you time out. Hey, hey, hey. Nah, should I put that shit on today? Hold on, let me show y'all niggas the fit on bro them. We got the A6 on feet. We got the Carhartt. what I tell y'all? I already showed y'all niggas the fit. This time I gotta show y'all again. Fuck you time. How you doing, shorty? How you doing? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Stupid ass boy. I don't fuck with this shit. Like I'm saying, man. I don't be out here doing this shit for the, the reasons everybody else be doing it for. I be doing this shit for myself, but y'all be like, well, you're doing it for yourself, so that means you're selfish. No, it's 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 a it's a oxymoron. It's like saying you're selfish, but then it's actually me being selfless because how can I help somebody else if I don't understand what's wrong with me first? If I don't solve the things wrong with me first? If I don't lead by example and say, I can come out here and do what I want to do without regardless of what anybody else thinks about me. I can have haters. What's up? What's up? What's up? Yes, sir. Aggie shit. Aggie shit. Aggie shit. Turn me up. Turn me up. <laughs> you see, like, you see how you radiate good energy? And niggas really just fuck with you, bro. Like, this shit really, like, that's why I love doing this shit, bro. I just want to be a good person, bro. And I do this shit for me, like, well, if you're doing it for yourself, then it means you're selfish, right? No. It just means that I understand how to influence a set of people. You wouldn't listen to Kanye if Kanye ain't had no money and didn't make good songs. You wouldn't listen to David Goggins if David Goggins wasn't the most disciplined person on the planet Earth. You wouldn't listen to Tate if he didn't have supercars. You wouldn't do none of that shit. Nigga, you wouldn't listen to Kobe if you want the best, the most mentally resilient person in the fucking league. You wouldn't do that. And he got the best shoes in the game. You wouldn't do that. You wouldn't listen to LeBron if he wasn't the greatest of all time. So you got to start leading by example. Again, you got to be a nigga that's going to step out here and say, I'm going to do what everybody else not going to do. You know what I'm saying? Just for the fact that nobody else doing it. Who the fuck you know out there recording? The only nigga I seen recording was a female. There is no nigga who just, who, they're, they're so scared. Like, they're almost like scared. And it's just like, that's why I'm doing this shit. So y'all niggas can stop being scared, man. There's no fucking reason to be scared, bro. This shit is so easy, bro. Like, I swear life gets so easy once you stop giving a fuck, bro. Like Yeet said, bro, I don't be giving no fucks. I don't know what you caught on. I don't be giving no fucks. Real talk, bro. Like, I, I really, really want y'all niggas to understand. This shit really, like, shit's nothing, bro. I'm just experiencing, expressing myself. Like, expressing my perception of the world through Mark, my nigga. And you, like, through Mark, bro. To yourself. That's all another conversation, because I'm not, I'm not Marcus, you know? That's just my name. That's just... That's just the, the person I am within this life. And most niggas not going to understand that. Most niggas be like, what the fuck are you talking about, bro? You talking crazy right now. But 
once you get the information I have in my mind, then you'll understand that, okay, he's actually speaking. He's actually understanding and shit like that. But hey, this is the conclusion of the video, my nigga. I want y'all niggas to understand. Uh, I really should have prayed. Uh, let's pray right now. Let's pray right now, chat. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Kingdom come, will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us the daily bread and forgive us for our trespasses, with those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For God is the kingdom, the power, the glory, forever and ever. Amen. God, I just want to say thank you for this wonderful day. Thank you for this wonderful, wonderful experience that I, I, I endured to number one help me out within my journey. Number two, help everybody out within their journey. God, I thank you for waking me up this morning. I thank you for the food on my stomach, the clothes on my back, the shoes on my feet. I thank you for the hair on my head, the brain that I have in order to even conjure up these words and, and understand and, and, and express my gratitude for you. I thank you for absolutely everything that you've done for me and everything that you're going to do for me. I pray that everybody watching this video has God within their heart. I pray that everybody watching this video understands that in order to believe in God, you have to believe in yourself because you are God. I want everybody in this video to understand that you need to love yourself first before you can love anybody else. I want everybody in this video to understand, understand, and understand that the only way to live is through love. With that being said, I love y'all. Hope y'all learned something about me, about yourself, and about the fucking world. With that being said, this includes the video. I went to an NCAT basketball game. I love y'all. God, I love y'all too. <laughs> now I'm living luxury. Turned up. Everybody fuck with me. Fuck with me. All these hoes in love with me. Trying to get in touch with me. Ay. Everybody look for what me. Up? They just want a buck from me. Can't trust, that's why I clutch my up this bitch and make them duck for me. <laughs> Used to be dead, broken, duck and blood. Guess what? No luck for me. Few niggas show love, they still love me and they stuck with me. Money rule the world, they wanna kill me. Bowing at my feet. Know the streets evil, but they feel me. Crowd me when I speak.